Let me offer a brief summary. <clears throat> Everyone who initially received the Johnson & Johnson vaccine should get a booster, but a vaccine of their choice is the booster two months after their initial vaccination. So it can be any of the three available vaccines for the booster and does not need to be J&J. &J. Now, for those who received either of the mRNA vaccines, those would be Pfizer or Moderna, we recommend that you get an additional dose if you're over the age of 65 or are immunocompromised. In addition, for those 18 and older who originally received either the Moderna or the Pfizer mRNA vaccines, boosters are recommended if they have a high risk medical condition, or if they live or work in a situation in which there's a high risk of COVID-19 transmission. Now, having said this, booster availability guidelines may be simplified in the near future to include anyone over the age of 16 based on a recent FDA request from Pfizer. In the meanwhile, rest assured that boosters are just that, a follow-up dose that bumps up the protection enjoyed by those who have completed their primary vaccination series, and that those who are vaccinated continue to enjoy high levels of protection against serious COVID illness that can lead to hospitalization and death, especially compared with their counterparts who remain unvaccinated.